Okay, so outbound dialogue mainly uh, three ways. Okay, today we are going to discuss about the second and third, which can be done without a back. Okay, the first one is mainly without a back we cannot do. It's a custom program. Uh, directly with a program we call the data and send to third party system. Okay, that is the one method. That I cannot uh, make it more. I cannot talk more on that because it's purely. Uh, the app will create a program by using that SAP standard program and the information maybe with a customized transaction or uh, custom functionality from there we get the data and we transmit to the third party system okay the second will be okay the first one like i mentioned it's a pure app related things and the second the message control so message control, like I mentioned, wherever you have output type, like PO output type, GR output type, IR output type, for these kind of a message control, we send the IDOC based on the output type. Okay, today I'm going to uh, explain you the PO status as an example. Okay, so the similar things will be applicable for other message types also. Okay, so that knowledge what you're going to get, that can be applied for other things. Okay, in future I may plan for other okay as a video for a youtube kind of a thing okay so message control is the best uh, example the mostly used because our pure status or gr all these transactional things we send with a message control and third one is the change pointers change pointer change documents what is this material master pricing conditions vendor master we don't have output type right so for these things there is a concept called change pointer almost all the configurations are similar like message control but additionally we need to do that change pointer uh, the configuration i mean i'm going to show that so here what happens in this case whatever you have done okay whatever you mentioned for example material is created system will generate automatically idoc you need to run one transaction so no output nothing based on the creation or change for example a material is created you go to the material and change the purchase group okay and uh, generally we don't run manually every time we just run the batch job one every one hour or every two hours like that so based on the batch job system will collect what are the newly material created and what are the changes to the materials for those materials it will collect and create an IDOC and send to the third party system means we will just send to that middleware only the middleware will take care and convert into the respective formats and send to the third party system the first option is directly a custom program based on the data we collect and with that program we generate uh, IDOC and we send to that okay that one uh, not very clear to show as a function consultant so the second and third we can do in IDA system so that I took one example of pure status and the material master to demonstrate you about those concepts. So message control wherever the output type by using output type we will generate an IDOC and send to the third party system. Change pointers we can activate it which material types you want to trigger and uh, for which plant you want to trigger okay those kind of a things also you can do it. So change pointers popular examples are our price condition records if you maintain in mk01 kind of a thing our material master okay and even in for record vendor master these are all kind of mostly my masters related things change pointers which don't have a output type thanks for watching my video and uh, if you have not yet subscribed to my channel you can click on the subscribe button you will see at the bottom of the video and uh, click on subscribe button and uh, if you click on this bell icon you can give all so whenever i upload a new video you will get the notification immediately so that you don't have to miss any of my new videos and uh, see once you watch the video if you really like the video and the content is helpful for your learning don't forget to click on the like button that will encourage to the YouTuber, not only myself, any videos. You may watch some ABAP videos, you may watch some S4 HANA videos, any kind of videos in the YouTube. You just hit a like. It takes one second of your time, but it helps a lot to the person.
and uh, you can uh, use this share button you can use the share button to share with uh, telegram or facebook or any kind of uh, social networks and uh, if you see this, this uh, description in the description you can uh, check my different playlists okay i mentioned all the purchasing inventory management discussion wm videos so you can use this uh, playlist to check my videos and you can uh, update your skills thanks for your time all the best for your future endeavors